Hey guys, I'm Adam. I'm Ryan. And this is Two Neighbors. What are we doing today, Ryan? All right guys, we are back with another Family Guy Try Not To Laugh. If you guys have seen our Family Guy Try Not To Laugh videos before, you'll remember that I am like 0 for 723. Some I don't know, like 0 and 5 or 0 and 6 or he something He has a 1-1. Like but today, guys, failure is not an option. God, if you saw like the compilation video, I think I said, you said the exact like same thing, so I don't think that means anything right now. Failure so. is not an option today. I am not gonna laugh at this hilarious video, I'm sure. So let's, so let's check it out. This one is called Family Guy Best Dark Humor Compilation 3. All right, let's do it. And everyone's just standing around doing nothing. Like the whole world during the Holocaust. Too true. Never again. Okay, now we've earned this gag about an anti-Semitic pigeon. Ugh, my allergies. And everything else. Just terrible. Choo, choo. All right, let's go. What should we leave for a tip? The food and service were both great. Give them the full 3%. Choo, choo, choo. Choo, choo, choo. This is why I hate going outside. <laughs> that was hilarious. And again, the global community's inaction during the Holocaust was unforgivable. Oh man, this toothpick is the best. I'm not going anywhere without it. Like Batman and his futility belt. I can't get these locks open. Don't you have something in your belt? Oh yeah, maybe. Let's see. I have some hockey trading cards, a post-it with some hair stuck to the edge, Something that might be a roll aid. I don't know, it's just loose. Hurry, it's getting closer! I have some stamps. Oh, you know what? It's a cert. Wow, that was awkward. Like a stranger trying to make conversation. It's painful. Long line, huh? There's two of us. Reminds me of that Steinfeld episode. No sauce for you, <laughs> right? It's just both of them. I can't believe that show's still on. It's not. I really like that Julia Richard Dreyfus, though. Ugh. Mr. Sanders, thank you for waiting. Here's the medicine for your brain injury. Oh, now I feel bad. Hello? Dad, Grandpa burned us with a curling iron, so we're at Farrell's ice cream. Would you come get us? I can't understand you. Stop calling me. Stupid foreigners. This group needs quagmire. Just like an Asian man needs facial hair to be taken seriously. I'm sorry, we're out of orange chicken. I don't believe you. He's right. We ran out two hours ago. You, I believe. You need to do something different and creative. Really? What about being a pilot? Eh, it's just not a challenge anymore. These days the autopilot does everything. Can I get you anything, Captain? You can get me some of this, toots. Okay, I guess I'll just sit here and read a fucking magazine. What? Drugging a baby? My god, that's a worse idea than letting Bono pick out his own glasses. No, no, no. I need something way more ridiculous. Something that a cartoon villain would wear. Well, I do have some horn rings. Look, you're not hearing me. I need my glasses to look like something either not yet invented or from an ancient Egyptian tomb. And if possible, they should look as though they cost a million dollars, but also came free in a box of cereal. Perhaps I can be of help, Mr. Bono. You have somewhat of a square face, so to offset that, I recommend these frames, made for an intergalactic homosexual. Perfect. Ah, like Christopher Columbus. Guys, I know this has been a long voyage. Half of us have died of starvation. We all saw Billy rot out from the stomach. We saw Roger's face get eaten by a seagull. And who could forget when Dave's bum sealed shut until he filled with poo and died. But it's all gonna be worth it. Trust me, because the spices here are amazing. Our mattress still has the chalk outline from where my Uncle Leonard got killed by his third wife. She poured boiling grits on his privates and then shot him. You sleep on that? Well, yeah, flipped it over. Don't be so hard on yourself, Peter. Your life's not over yet. Come on, it's not like I can go back to school at my age. I'll never be a doctor. The best I could hope for is a male nurse who's probably killing all his patients. Well, I'm going home. Griffin, you have another eight hours on your shift. Now, what about your patients? They all died with dignity, God bless them. But first, sad news from the Quahog Zoo as a baby panda on loan from China is undergoing emergency treatment for what appears to be tater tot poisoning. The Chinese ambassador was quoted as saying, Ooh, tiger mom, egg foo young, practice your piano math. I don't know, probably not that. So close. 
That's it. That's it. Ryan. I almost lost it 10 seconds in again with those Jewish seagulls or whatever. Oh my god. So he, he wins once. I got one. Well, it's tied. Beat. It's technically tied. But I didn't. We both made it. We didn't. I laugh. like, I won just because I didn't laugh. That's what I'm giving myself the W. So. Uh, <laughs> that was pretty good. It was good. Okay. I think we can do better. Yeah. I. You know what? It. I will say this. I'm going to happily take the win there. Well. Tie. Win, okay. I'll happily take the tie. I didn't laugh this time. Yeah. But it wasn't the absolute funniest no. compilation no. ever. Um. But I didn't laugh for once. But maybe you could help us and put some suggestions down below. Yeah. And when you do that, please use the hashtag my request with a link. A link always helps. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, we'll do another one for sure. And we'll keep them coming. Right on. What else do they do, Ryan? I don't know, guys. I didn't laugh. I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Later. <laughs>